Hello YouTube, and welcome to our 2021 arcade room update. Here we have our arcade as it is now. We have since moved and are now in a different room, as you can see. So we're just going to show you what our arcade looks like now. So we'll start off over here. We got Space Invaders on the end. Looking good as always. We got our first one here, Galaga. We got Pac-Man. We decided to go with this corner design. We believe it looks very nice. We got a new one, Frogger. It's not on, but this one has the lighted control deck. The back is not screwed on yet because we're waiting for a part and we don't want to put holes in it yet. And then we got Mortal Kombat 2 on the end. And we also installed some LED lights on our walls. It looks much better in person. Then we got some Lego cars displayed over there, but we might, we're gonna put more machines over there when we get them. We're thinking about the class of 81 and the Atari Legacy. Yep, those would fit well. They're expensive though, they're getting expensive. Yeah, that's the downside. If you're watching this, you definitely know that. So this one, we got it on Amazon. It came, it's just the normal one. It didn't come with the light control deck, but our control deck was broken. So we ended up getting a replacement. They sent us this one. So now we need the splitter. So this works and this works. Here we have the stock one. Notice that on the lighted one, like the trim around the joystick and numbers is just white. And then the off and on labels are not black outlined. And this piece makes it not really, doesn't really flow well with the tire design. It still works. But when it's on, it looks great. So yeah, this doesn't work. Yeah, it wouldn't power on. Anyone uh, dealing with arcade went up trouble, don't worry, their customer service is great. As you can see, this one's a lighted marquee, that one's the lighted marquee, that one's lighted. These two are not, these and two are older models. I have the lighted control panel, it looks really nice. Has a bunch of different color settings. I usually set it to whatever the LEDs are on. Yeah, this is multicolor. It does show all the dust in there and stuff, so. And fingerprints. Yeah. I still like it though. When I was installing the first deck protector, kind of cracked it a little bit. Now with this one, I was like, Trying like not to crack it, but well, it still broke a bit. So maybe they're not made as well because I've unscrewed the other ones many times, but this one just didn't. This one just cracked, and this one has like graphics on the deck protector, so not really. Yeah, these white really lines crazy. in the tires that's on the deck protector. The black without the white lines is on the control panel. Yeah, just a tip if you ever. If your machine never doesn't power on, just uh, swap out control decks with another unit and see if it works then, because that's what we did and it worked then. So then we just got a free replacement and they sent us the lighted one. See, that was cool. Yeah, we really like the Frogger machine. I don't know how hard it is to come by, but. All right, that's our arcade in its current state.
We hope you enjoyed this video and we will see you again soon.